Okay, have and have not fans, this is a special theory that again my mom and I discuss over the phone and my mom just opened up Pandora's box because the title of this theory is Will Mitch make things worse for Candace than it already is? Will his, you know, the fact that we just learned that he is brothers with the Malones, he called in to his brothers for a crooked cop to pull over Warlock because they're going to stash drugs and money in his car to get him arrested. My mom, again, again, just like the, um, the is Catherine dreaming, this theory just blew my mind. Okay, hear me out. Play by play, step one. So we have Mitch, again, calling his brothers to set up Warlock by stashing money and drugs in his car. And then they'll have a cop pull him over and arrest him because they'll find drugs and money in there. This most likely will happen after we see Candace give the $2 million to Warlock because in the preview for the next episode, I believe we saw a black bag full of money. It looks like he's counting just to make sure it's all there. So, you know, Benny's life is saved as well as Candace being off the hook for now. Warlock leaves. Next thing you know, it could be the cliffhanger for this week or maybe next week's episode. Warlock is pulled over by the cop that, you know, the Malone brothers have set up and he gets taken to jail. Moving on, we know that Jim is currently in jail. Who's to say that Warlock, after getting arrested, will be taken to the cell that's adjacent or the same cell as Jim Cryer? Then the two exchange words. You know, Warlock, Jim will be either frightened or a bit, you know, well, 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 look who it is. You know, the fact that he finally has warlock behind bars like he wanted even though he's behind bars himself i think that during that time if if it does play out as the theory just presented itself again you know candace gives warlock the money she thinks she's good she's good but then it turns out mitch went behind her back to call in the malones to get him set up to be arrested warlock might think that candace set everything up like he got the money, but then the cops come find the drugs and everything because he knows he didn't have drugs in the car. It was Mitch and his brothers that set him up. So if he gets taken to jail, he will be furious at Candace. And then the fact that him and Jim might be together in cells, they might start talking and Warlock might find out that it wasn't $500,000. It wasn't $4 million. It was $7.4 million dollars that she extorted from Jim, meaning that Warlock is going to find out she lied to him again, and he will be even more furious thinking that she set him up to get arrested. So an um, unholy alliance might occur between Jim and Warlock because my mom and I, ever since the episode, I believe it was like the first or second episode of season three, where Jim is trying to trick, well, not trick, but convince Warlock when she, when Candace sashays her ass down there, let me out of here and put her in the chair. It's like, I'll pay you double whatever she's paying. I think this would be an interesting twist here. And again, the fact that Warlock and Jim will get out and start, you know, start going after Candace again. It might lead to that eventual war between Warlock and his crew versus the Malones. The ones I really want to see that go down. So I believe that's pretty much the basis of my theory that. And every time somebody goes behind somebody's back to do something, it ends up blowing up in their face or making things worse. I think that Mitch's interference might make things worse for Candace than it already is. Because once she pays Warlock the money, she thinks she's going to be in a free and clear. With the only two obstacles, I believe, being, well, three, uh, Quincy's body in the backyard. You know, she has to get the evidence from Pearl away. The fact she has pictures of video. Uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, well, Veronica, well, that goes, number one, the Quincy body thing goes back to Veronica knowing about the murder. And number three, the unseen one being that she signed that contract with the bank where she does have the money in like two weeks. They're going to foreclose on everything. So do you think that Warlock and Jim will join forces if he does get arrested and gets put in jail beside Jim and they start talking? Uh, not to mention, I really think that Warlock was the supplier of, to why it's right hand man that gave him the drugs i really think that's the thing so with that being said you know i'll bring this video to a close but do you think this theory has any weight behind it i really think it's an interesting one again my mom came up with it so please comment subscribe like and share and i'll see you all next time